Tonight, China is responding now after the U.S. shot down that massive balloon floating all across the country. Intelligence officials say it was sent to spy on us. Now China is threatening retaliation as the U.S. searches for pieces of that big balloon. Tonight, authorities are searching for debris in the Atlantic Ocean after shooting down a Chinese surveillance balloon. Navy and Coast Guard ships have established a secure perimeter in U.S. waters. An F-22 fired a single missile separating the payload from the balloon. They're going to be looking for the sensor package that was underneath that balloon. Remember that the administration said that this was a spy balloon. And so what was being used to spy? Was it cameras? Were there signal intelligence capabilities? President Biden, who approved the operation, praised the effort. I ordered the Pentagon to shoot it down on Wednesday as soon as possible without doing damage to anyone on, on the ground. We decided that the best time to do that was when we got over the water. The enormous balloon drifted for days first entering American airspace over Alaska, before heading southeast over Montana, Missouri, and the Carolinas. In the wake of the downing of the balloon, the Chinese government is threatening repercussions, calling it a serious violation of international practice. The real question here is why the Chinese decided to deliberately provoke the U.S. to go into sovereign U.S. airspace just before the first high-level meeting between two senior officials in years. And the U.S. now says there is a second Chinese spy balloon hovering over Latin American countries right now. China has not responded to questions about that balloon.